here from the Race Coaching YouTube channel. Happy Friday and welcome to episode 7 of my Project 245 uh, video series. Now today I wanted to cover all things bass. Now not the guitar bass uh, like in the cover photo but more about running bass in preparation for a marathon. So over the years I've read loads and loads of different blogs, posts, stories from people all over the place about what the ideal kind of mileage base is to run certain marathon times. So I'm really keen to hear from you guys um, what's worked for you in the past, for those of you who have run kind of sub 245, but also for those of you who have run a little bit longer than that. So I, I took a little bit of time earlier and looked through some of my stats from my last two marathons. So that was Chicago um, last October, where I ran my PB of 255. And then kind of six months earlier where I ran uh, 258 in, in Manchester. And I did a bit of a comparison in terms of the mileage I was doing, frequency of runs, and just uh, if there was really any obvious anomalies between them. And the key thing I looked at, so Manchester, I was probably running uh, late 30s into early 40 miles per week as a guide. And I would think probably over five five days. Um the thing I found with me, if I go too high for mileage into the 60, 70, 80 miles, I just cannot sustain it. Um, you know, I tend to be a bit injury prone, unfortunately. Um, I think some of that's probably due to the fact that I wear a lot of light footwear. I don't wear really heavy footwear just because I don't really get along with them too well. Um, and yeah, so I did kind of yeah, 40 miles for, for, for Manchester, five days a week and ran the sub three there um, by kind of 90 seconds. And then fast forward, yeah, six months, and I did a slightly different tactic here. So I had a lot, uh, a much shorter training bout. So I'd come off the back of some ultras earlier in the summer. Uh, so I had, didn't have as many weeks as I would have liked. Um, and I ended up running kind of more over four days, but getting a lot better quality in and upping it to around 45 miles a week. So not a massive increase, but obviously running more miles on the days that I was training. And then off the back of that, I definitely felt stronger having run more longer stuff at a quicker pace for Chicago, which gave me those extra kind of, you know, two and a half, three minutes on the day as well. And bear in mind, that was of a shorter period. So I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, you know, the theory suggests that if I can get up to kind of 50, 55 miles, um, I don't think I'll get much higher than that, to be honest, because it starts to hit my breaking point. Will I, you know, will that be the saving grace for me to run that kind of 245? Let me know. I'd love to hear from you all. Uh, again, please do subscribe and have a great weekend. I'll catch you later. Cheers, guys.